Welcome to February 2018. Welcome to Black History Month. This year marks the 150th birthday of W.E.B. Du Bois. Here are some of the events we have to celebrate. Our 24th annual Du Bois lecture will feature Dr. Raylan Rabaka. He will be doing two lectures. The first lecture is on February 21st in Old Chapel, and that event is from 4 to 6 p.m. Our second event is held in Great Barrington, the birthplace of Du Bois, and that will be on his birthday on February 23rd. That lecture will feature local artists, local poets, and a number of friends and supporters of Du Bois's legacy out in Great Barrington and partners with UMass. So we're very excited about that event as well. For the month of February, we will be honoring the legacy of W.E.B. Du Bois as a son of Massachusetts by lending the Du Bois Center's traveling exhibit to the State House. It will be on display on the fourth floor from February 12th to March 2nd. In honor of Du Bois' 150th birthday, the Du Bois Center, UMass Libraries, and UMass Press, and the Department of Afro-American Studies here at UMass have all gotten together to create the UMass Press edition of The Souls of Black Folk, featuring an introduction by alumnus Sean Alexander. We hope you'll join us for one, if not all, of these events. And I'd like to leave you with one of my favorite Du Bois quotes that really speak to how important this month is and this year ahead. I have loved my work. I have loved people and play. But always, I have been uplifted by the thought that what I have done well will live long and justify my life. That what I have done ill or never finished can now be handed on to others for endless days to be finished, perhaps better than I could ever have done. And that piece will be my applause. That is by W.B. Du Bois written on June 26, 1957, with specific instructions not to be opened until after his death. Thank you and happy birthday, Du Bois.